to our channel Blooming Days. Today we are here in front of you with an easy recipe for Alu Matar Kima. This is very tasty and delicious. It can be eaten with naans, roti, tugus, chapati, kg of grinded beef, 1 tablespoon of coriander powder, 1 tablespoon of red chili powder, 1 teaspoon of garam masala, half teaspoon of turmeric powder, half teaspoon of cumin seeds, half teaspoon of black pepper powder, 1 pinch of any Greek seeds, 1 and a half tablespoon of yogurt. Spices we using here are dried red chilli, cardamom, cloves and cinnamon. Two chopped onions, one tomato, two tablespoon ginger garlic paste, chopped coriander, half piece of fried chilli, two or three green chilli, coriander, one potato, green peas, Half cup of oil and salt for taste. First, we need to boil the beef. For this, we add turmeric powder, salt, enough water and a little bit of oil. Now add a little oil to it. Now let's boil the beef. Meantime, we will start making masala for the kima. First, add oil. Fry up our red chilies. Now let's take the red chilies. We will keep the chili aside. Add our spices, cardamom, cloves, Cinnamon. Then fry well. Add onion and salt well until it becomes well cooked. Now let's add salt. Now our onions are well cooked. Now we can add green chili and ginger garlic paste. Then mix it well. When the onions are turning brown, add coriander powder, turmeric powder, garam masala, and red chili powder. Then mix it well. Pepper powder, fenugreek seeds, and cumin seeds. Then mix it well. Add tomato and yogurt. Then mix it well. Our cook the beef. Sit well. Now add potatoes. Then mix it well. Add our beef stock. Then mix it well.
sheep aside. Then mix it well. for 15 minutes close the lid for 15 minutes add 1 tablespoon of ghee some coriander then mix it well now our keema is ready we will add some coriander for garnishing.